Hey, Craig Gordon here, along with my colleague Ted Scrogan. We're in the western Uintas today at nearly 10,000 feet on a northeast facing slope. We're giving you 24 extra hours of fun today because it's a leap year. It's the 29th, and we're rolling out the month in style. We've got this storm snow from yesterday. Nice fist density snow. Stuff is starting to consolidate. It's warm, it's spongy, it's creamy. A little bit of near surface faceting going on here that occurred over the weekend. We're not even finding any results with that in our snow pit test. And then as we get into this stuff, man, this just gets stronger and stronger and stronger. There's over 250 centimeters of snow on this slope. So that's more snow than I am tall, over six feet of snow. Where the snowpack is deep, it's strong, it's bomber. The problem is, steep rocky slopes facing the north half of the compass. That's gonna complicate the uh, stability picture, especially in the next couple of days moving forward. Big winds, big water, big snow. So we're gonna see elevated avalanche danger through the weekend. Let's uh, keep it tight going into the early part of March. Some of these slopes might start to react. They might start to light up. We got your back. We'll keep you covered. We'll keep you updated. UtahAvalancheCenter.org.